Hello everyone, welcome to Pandey Guruji YouTube channel. In this video, I will I am going to discuss about the uh, very important interview question, uh, which is related to the uh, performance tuning. So the reason the performance tuning is plays very a uh, major role if you work in the real time environment. Okay, so uh, performance is the major area where uh, lots of the company or the client facing the issue. Uh, because uh, if you if, if the any of the client or the user uh, they access the data from the database through the application if the code or the store procedure have the lower performance so it will be impact on the uh, client or the user so that is the reason uh, if you have the good understanding of the uh, performance tuning part uh, this is a very helpful to you crack any type of the interview so this common question uh, basically uh, ask in the interview and uh, uh, this question will help to understand the student have the understanding of the complete performance or not so we already know the we have the two type of the major uh, indexes there one is the cluster index second one is the non cluster index if you attend the interview and if any interviewer will ask you uh, which is the more speed cluster index or non cluster index so so might be your answer will be s uh, cluster index will be faster than non cluster index so cluster index have the much faster than non cluster index then immediate the interviewer will put the question what is the reason behind it so if you not able to explain like uh, why the cluster index is faster and why non cluster index is slower then this is a very big impact on the interviewer you don't have the understanding of the uh, any type of the index in the sql so in this video i will discuss in the detail why cluster index is faster and uh, why non cluster index slower which scenario we have the cluster index faster and what scenario we have the non cluster index faster okay so before starting if you want to learn the complete sql you can download the uh, my mobile app which is available in the play store that is the studyit education you can also enroll the course on the studyitteducation.com to learn the complete sql one by one or the you can also practice all the interview question so uh, let's discuss about the first this question what is the answer so basically if you talk about the uh, concept of the cluster and non cluster index so uh, cluster index is basically uh, created only one cluster index in a table but we can create multiple cluster index table so just you can understand what is the basic concept of the cluster index and what structure the cluster index follow so basically cl cluster indexes is follow the b tree data structure so whenever any type of the uh, cluster index created in a table so they follow the b tree structure like if you create the uh, on, on the employee id column so like uh, employee id we have uh, uh, 1 to 10000 okay so 1 to uh, 1 to 5000 so they can create the index uh, uh, like the tree structure so root level we have 1 to 5000 they sub divide the intermediate level 1 to 25000 and uh, 5000 to 75000 so whatever the data have the they create the tree and the leaf structure and data is basically sort in the physically order so let's understand how the data is going to sort so through the practical we can better understand here so uh, let's see example I have this table like uh, employee index table is there and I have the employee ID, employee name in employee salary. So if you create this table, okay, and uh, once you insert the data here, so like for example, I'm inserting one, five, four, two, three. So whatever the way you inserting in the same way, data is also inserted into the table. So now if you insert this data in the table, and if you put the select star from uh, whatever the tail, table name so now you can see the data is showing in the same order so i have five record one five four two three so whenever you applied the cluster index 
so physically the data is got sorted so i am creating index create clustered index ix one table name and the table name i am creating the index on the basically employee id column so once you create under the employee id column the sql engine basically they sort the data now if you put the select star from table name here okay so now if you put the select star from table name the data now got sorted in the physically in the table so 1 2 3 now data i got sorted so might be they create 1 to 1 leaf and 3 4 another leaf 5 6 another leaf so whenever uh, the uh, any of the uh, uh, through the sources like the user they put the select star from a uh, table where employee is equal to 3 so they directly jump to the leaf where the three is created like uh, for example uh, we have this uh, pdf uh, like uh, where you can see like for example if you have the here 1 2 or here 2 3 3 5 so where the leaf will be there they directly jump it and they retrieve the data so that is the reason cluster index is very faster so if you compare with the non cluster index like i have another example here uh, so let me create one another table with the same type of the data uh, i have non uh, non cluster index i am creating in this scenario and same type of the data i am inserting okay so now if you if you ins insert the data and if you see the data is the same format whatever the data is inserted like 1 5 you can see 1 5 4 2 3 is coming now if you apply the non cluster index on a table so basically in the non cluster index the data is not ordered physically okay so if you select this table they basically whenever they created uh, they create one basically row id each row id they created uh, sql engine created each row id unique id which we cannot see and they store into the uh, sql server okay so whenever any of the developer or the user request employee is equal to 2 they directly jump to the particular row id of the 2 and they fetch all the information so in the future if anything uh, related to the select statement so select statement might be cluster index is the faster but whenever you have talk about the update uh, something a statement or the insert statement a non cluster will be uh, uh, faster okay so whenever if you have inserting the bulk amount of data if you inserting the bulk amount of data and uh, let's see we have the table have the cluster index then it got slow so so the real time whenever we working with the bulk insert uh, first we need to be drop the indexes okay so uh, if you if you insert the bulk insert data okay uh bulk insert like uh, if you have the million of the data like 10 million record if you uh, inserting so so 10 million record inserted first what you first step you need to be do first you can uh, uh, first you can drop the indexes okay so you can drop the indexes and then second step what you need to do you can then insert the data into table okay insert data again what you need to do again recreate the indexes okay so again re uh, create the indexes uh, whatever uh, you have the table recreate the indexes so this is the better performance wise if you have the indexes uh, in a table so you need to be explain the detail okay so like the you need to be follow the bit tree structure whatever i discuss so if you explain this type of the question or the answer then the interviewer they can understand that they have you have the uh, complete knowledge on uh, particular cluster index or in, uh, non cluster index still if you have any question if you have any doubt uh, you can reach out to me uh, through the uh, video uh, video comment so uh, if you if you want to learn the complete sequel you can just uh, enroll in all these courses so thank you so much for the watching and please don't forget to I uh, download my app and uh, read the app in the play store so thank you so much for the watching this video i uh, will meet again on next video thank you